It's more than a jumper. It's a tradition, a legacy. It crosses our hearts and unites us all. And now, more than ever. It's time to don the sash. Reedy, you join us in the recovery room. Paul Chapman, we saw him come off early the other night. What's the update on him? Uh, about five minutes to go, he got a his um, lower leg squashed, if you like, contused. And he was a bit sore over his fibula, so we just took him down and checked him, but all he's got is uh, bruising to his anterior compartment. By the time we got him back, uh, it was only two minutes to go, so we iced him and he trained on Sunday. So there will be no issues, he'll be fine for this uh, week? He'll definitely be playing. Um, Jason Windlick, is he a chance to line up this weekend? Yeah, well, Jason's now been in full training uh, for the last five days and is out there training now. He, um, he's had a lot of hamstrings, but this particular hamstring is on his right leg. All his problems are on the leg. He had sciatica and had the Rico on. This is on his other leg, which he's only had one hamstring strain, and that was in 2007. So we gave him an extra week, but he's been full training now for at least a week. Uh, Nick Commons, one we haven't seen much of. Can you bring us the latest there? Yeah, Nick, Nick's, uh, Nick and Will Hams have been our two problems. Uh, one's with a psoas tendon and one's with a patella tendon. Nick Commons got a patella tendon, which really flared up uh, perhaps five or six weeks ago. And he, he's improving, but he's been slow, so we don't expect him probably playing for another three weeks or so. Um, Lachlan Dalgleish, another one we haven't seen much of. You gave us an update on him recently. Where's he at? Uh, Lockie Dalgleish is now, uh, he's our Achilles. And uh, we've taken our time there, but he's back in full training. He's out there training with the main group now. Tom Bell Chambers, he had that ankle surgery. Is he still on track for sort of that round five, six mark? Yeah, Tommy's doing very well. Our best aim was round five, uh, and he's not far off that. He, he, I'd be, he's out now running freely without a limp, um, doing agility work. So, uh, yep, we do, we'll have to get a bit of fitness into him, but he's probably back to reasonably hard training in the next two weeks. And the weekly update, it seems, Alex Brown with his knee. Where's, where's he at in his progress? Well, Alex, uh, Alex is doing just fine. Yeah, it always takes a week or two to get your quads going after major surgery, but um, he's doing fine. But uh, there's no rush. There's no rush. Brady, thanks for the update. Thank you very much. <laughs>